Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name's Sam. This is my brother Justin. Today we're going to be opening the Pokemon Center Roaring Moon exclusive ETB. We opened the Iron Hands one, uh, but we messed up and the video is no good. So we're going to get this one. Uh, we're going, we're going to open this one and show you at the end of the video what hits we got from the other one. But let me go ahead and get this, this one opened. Open this one and hopefully we get some good hits out of it. Yeah, I like the colors on this one too. The issue is like super bright, super vibrant. Yeah, I mean the artwork's uh, awesome. I prefer the Iron Valiant myself. Yeah. Um, I don't like the artwork on this one as much, but it's kinda it's still good. Kind of reminds me of like a comic book or something. Yeah, that's true. It does. Like the colors are super bright. And really high contrast yeah and also uh the timing of this video i don't know when uh they're gonna go out but the uh, pokemon center ones are in stock on the pokemon center as of right now when you watch this video they may not be um but you know i've seen people selling the promos out of these for like 50 bucks don't do it i mean there's no point i mean just go literally pick one of these up from the pokemon center if they're still available pay the extra ten dollars and go grab it because i couldn't i couldn't believe that people were actually i mean i try to let them know like hey this is in stock um but you know i mean people are going to do what they want to do i don't I'm, I'm not going to tell them how to use their money but <laughs> i'm just throwing it out there these are in stock um right now i don't know when you're going to be watching this so um but yeah i like the artwork you know it's just a standard etb uh these come with 11 packs. Um, the normal ones come with nine. The difference is, is these are directly from the Pokemon Center, so they are gonna feature two extra packs. Um, it also comes with some promos. Um, you get one of each, one with a Pokemon Center stamp and a regular one. Let me go ahead and, yeah, it should be 11, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11. D dang, we didn't get lucky this time. They didn't add in an extra few packs. <laughs> Um, that does happen. Yeah, I, I mean, I, I, yeah, it does. Um, then we got, oops, then we got the um, card backs, just gonna be the same artwork that's on the ETB. And these are going to be the promos. Let's see what we got here. This one I don't think I've seen yet, so. Are oh you, wow! Are you missing one? Yeah. No way. I uh, I'm actually. They didn't give me the Pokemon Center one. Wow. This actually has the. I mean, unless I'm missing it here, but I don't think so. Yeah. Ooh, might have to send a ticket. Yeah, or it's good. We're support. recording this. Yeah, for sure. Um, I mean, let me make sure here. Yeah, maybe it's like hiding between some packs or something. Wow. No, I just went through it. That it's is not in crazy. here. I mean, unless they put... I mean, they wouldn't put both in here, no? Uh, I mean, no, usually, there's no way. Yeah, they usually wouldn't, for sure. Yeah, they... Yeah, so this one doesn't have the... Let's see if it's in here somewhere. Like, maybe it, like... Yeah, can you check the box? Because it's definitely not in here. You got the guy. Yeah, I have the dice, the markers, but it does not look like the promo with the Pokemon Center stamp is in here. Oh, one sec, guys. We're just making sure because I don't want to put in a ticket if they put it in here, but it doesn't look like they did. Um, it was not in the box. So normally, I don't know. It, so when you open, when you order from the Pokemon Center, you actually get two. You get one with the Pokemon Center stamp. Oh, it's right here. Oh, is it there? Yeah, yeah, it was like stuck to the side. Oh, it was it was it was in this. Oh, it was, it was, it was like in, in the. In the yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah, I'll show it, show it to the uh, to the people here. Yeah, yeah. So it was like stuck in this little crease in here, so it was just like totally hidden. Yeah, totally. yeah, yeah. I was like, oh, dude, there was uh, no way. It's come on. Let me make sure this thing's also in focus. Yeah, I was about to be like, bro, what? Um, it looks like it was just at the side though. Yeah, okay, it is. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, and we do need the. Uh, the card one to auto focus because you're going to be moving. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This yeah. is just for the webcam. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So okay, so see. crisis averted. So here we go. So it's going to have the Pokemon Center stamp like this. Yeah. 
This is a sick looking card. Dude. Yeah, yeah, it is. This is actually one of my favorite cards in the entire set. Um, luckily, it's a promo. I don't have to pull it, but yeah, this looks really good. It does. I like it a lot. Um, well, that was a scare. Yeah, it was. That was um, pretty spooky. Moving on, though, yeah, it's just the standard dice markers, you know. Same thing as you'd expect to find in all the ETBs, and then you got your energies. Uh, I'm not going to open this because, uh, you know, people cope and they're like, maybe they put something in here. <laughs> no. it, it, they never. It's just, no. No. All right. So let's go ahead and open some packs. All right. Try and clean up a little bit and get out of the way here. So let me put this over here because I don't want it to get messed up. And all right. Let's 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 get into the pack opening. We we had a heart attack there for a second, but we're good now. Yeah, so. as well. Here we go. First pack magic. Let's see if we can get anything good. The cards we're going for is going to be like uh, Tula, Parasol Lady, uh, you know, um, there's a lot of awesome artwork cards in this set. For whatever reason, it wasn't popular in Japan. I don't know why. Um, but... They do look really good, though. Yeah, I mean, I don't know why people don't like this set. I mean, it, it, it looks good to me. Yeah, I like it. Um, let's but see. let's jump into it here. So... Basic energy, I like it. Vanillish. Hopefully like you can see this too well. Love that ice cream. One of my favorite Pokemon. Well, they don't know you said it because our last video right, got messed right, up. Right, 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 right. That's okay. This is our first time making a video, so if you've found this by luck or whatever, I appreciate you watching and chilling with us while we open some packs and uh, I'll be uploading more content soon. So, you know, hit give your boy a like and a subscribe if you like it. If you don't, that's cool too. Um, really like this scream tail. Yeah, I made a comment about this in the other video that's never going to be seen. But, <laughs> um, yeah, the texture on here is really nice. I really like it. Um, the ancient cards. This one's actually a little bit different than the other ones. Uh, it's like half and half. I see that. Um, I don't know if my other scream tail looks like that, but that does look pretty good. All right, moving on. We got Nimble, Jirachi, one of my favorites, and then a hollow group on it. Okay, very nice first pack. Yeah, we can do better. See if that other, uh, that other scream tail, like if maybe that was just a unique print. Or... Uh, yeah, we'll have to look at it afterwards. Yeah, yeah definitely. Oops, getting away from me. Oopsie. All right, here we go. Second pack. There's 11 packs total in here, so we'll move it along here. Pan Sage, Manti, Gabite, Minun, Toad's Cruel. Toad's Cruel didn't look like that back in my day. No, he sure didn't. He, he green. Yeah, it is. Okay, so it is half and half. Yeah, most of these. So, yeah. Yeah. Okay. So, it looks like the ancient cards. Yeah. Got them wavy. It's just a half there. Yeah. Brute Bonnet. Uh, Apon. Oh, nice, Golden EX. Hey. So, we'll take that. That is actually one of the cards. Uh, my friend actually wanted the alternate art, and she ended up getting this one, and she was sad. <laughs> but I was like, hey, at least you got one yeah, of them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I you think know. it sick, even the regular EX. Yeah, look at that boy. Yeah, he happy. He look rich. Yeah. Let's go ahead and sleeve that. Nice. So, second pack in, we get a hit. I'm not mad about that. Not too shabby. Let me, let me just put these over here for right now. And let's open this bad boy up. Yep, we got uh, nine packs to go. We want plenty of time. We want, um, I'm trying to remember what it was. I don't have to list that, but there's a, a considerable amount of cards in this set that I'm looking for. Yeah, like there's over 240 in this set. It's very big. Yeah, it's the biggest Scarlet and Violet set by far. Yeah. All right. Basic Energy, Charcada, and we do have something in here. I can see it at the back. Ooh. Um, um, so yeah, hopefully cheat. we get something good here. I didn't cheat. <laughs> I can just see it in the background. <laughs> Wiglet, Iron Bundle, nice Earthorn, Curse Duster, okay. Slitherwing. Okay, so here we go. I don't think I'm being baited, but I could be. So let's see what it is. Oh, I got hard baited. Yeah, you know what it is? It, it, for the content. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah the it's... silver borders. I swear, man. It's like every time, uh, it actually. It, it baits me every time. I'm like, oh, I got something, and then it ends up being like a, a like a regular holo. Back in the yellow border days, it's like if you saw silver, it meant for sure, you know. Yeah. So, yeah. That's yeah. So the silver borders really. The boomer takes. The boomer Back takes. in my day, the borders were yellow. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. 
two kids with their new hot rods uh -huh. and bells and whistles. We had to walk up. See, like this one, things. I'm like, oh, I, I definitely see something, but we'll see. We'll, yeah. see. we'll see. Let me not hype it up too much, and then we get nothing. Wimpod, Wicked, Explod, Mella. That's definitely one of the cards I want in oh, the yeah. alternate art versions. Minior, Yamaz. Oh, oh, nice, dude. We got Garbage Boy. <laughs> That's the alt art variant. Yeah, and then people. Dude, that is a cool looking card. Yeah, bro. this is a dope card. So I like it a lot. Yeah, he, that boy's sitting in his home. Look, on a pile of trash. Look how much the artwork goes in here, though. Like, it goes hard. Like So detailed. Yeah, the broken fan in the back. The um, This right here. We got the couch. I don't know what it <laughs> is. Is it like a it lamp? I don't know. It looks like a lamp. Yeah. And then, uh, yeah, no. Awesome card. Very 10 nice. out of 10. I like it. Pretty. I'm glad we pulled it. Yeah, that's great, man. Sleeve this bad boy here, and we'll continue on. I'm just gonna put my head right here, just so like we can kind of know. Yeah, yeah, you can kind of keep a tally, keep track. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then here, let me I'm trying to find a good place for him. Well, yeah, just because the quality, it's kind of like here. Uh, pick the pick the card up, read the camera, and then set it back down. Like cause the camera to bring it down. There it goes. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. You just had to tell the camera to refocus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You better do that. Focus. Yeah, focus. Focus up. Focus up, boy. All right. Tyler one made us way into this video. I know, dude. My big Tonka T, my boy. Yeah. If any of you play League of Legends, you know what I'm talking about. If you do not, good. Run far <laughs> away. Never play that game ever. Oh, it will steal your soul. It will. All right. Here we go. Let's let's go. Good luck, Charm. Right here, here we can go. We got a Gimme Ghoul. Oh, another one of the cards I really want. Jirachi. Oh, is there an altar Gimme Ghoul? Yeah, there is. I'm oh. pretty. I'm pretty sure there is. Yeah. Parasol Lady. Uh, I I definitely want that card. Yeah, for sure. And Beetle Claw. And and Espartha. So this is actually ironically this is like one of my favorite cards in the set because it has tulip in the background oh yeah it's here you see that yeah yeah, yeah yeah so this is actually a really cool card um i'm actually gonna sleeve this um you want at least one copy one yeah copy. i want i want one copy yeah um i do like this card not just because it has a girl on it but just because like you know the artwork <laughs> i'm totally not a DJ, no, so you not know a, not a degen, really. no 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 not like those other other guys. Yeah. <laughs> this pack feels heavy. Ooh, let's see. Let's see if your uh, your weighing skills are betraying you. Yeah, I know. All right. Let's see. Also, just as a side note, not too long ago, I opened some evolving skies, and I learned the hard way why they call it evolving cries. Yeah. Uh, it was not a good time. Yeah, you just open up so many and get nothing. Uh, yeah. Brutal. Definitely brutal. Krusty, Truby, Oni, Dondi. You, you alright over there? No. No. <laughs> we got a hollow tulip. Oh, Ooh, Mewtwo. It's Mewtwo my boy EX. coming in hot. Mewtwo EX. Electric Mewtwo. It's so strange. Yeah, it is. It's very weird. <laughs> I'll take it though. Yeah, definitely. It looks like the. I don't know. It does look like the quality control is getting a little bit better. Oh, is the scenario on all these seem pretty solid? I mean, I don't want to speak too soon, but it doesn't seem as bad. I mean, I don't know. But, I mean, there are... It doesn't... It's not terrible. Yeah, we've seen some bad ones. It's... Recently. Uh, yeah. yeah. It's been extremely bad lately. I mean, the quality control on these cards are just awful. I mean, not this... So far, not this set from what I've seen, but yeah, like the past cards, you know, it feels really bad when you get like a really good hit and it's like the furthest way left and it's just like, you're like, man, I'm trying to, I'm trying to get a good card for my personal collection that I want to hold on to and yeah. like gain value over time if that's what you're into, if you're into the value of the cards. Even if you're not, even if you're just collecting it and you it's don't care person. about it, yeah, you want it to look centered and look well. It doesn't have to be perfect, but some of these cards I'm seeing, especially in Scarlet and Violet era, it's been pretty bad here lately, but these seem to be looking a little bit better. Yeah, definitely. But hey, look at it this way. If you get enough of an error, 
then it's really unique and the value goes up, you know? I like, mean... It's going to be pretty dank, but... True. You know, I'll take it if you I'll give like. you that. <laughs> We're going two. Yeah. You know? It's the bits the boy. Number two? The bubble boy. Octillery. Golbat. My Ooh. boy, that's my son right there. Yeah, yeah. Larry is my long lost father, dude. Represent Larry. He's deserved so much better. Give this man a vacation and a break. And a raise. And a raise. Yeah. I mean, Pokemon Company, do it now. Do better in the next game and give Larry give CEO position. Tatsubiri Sushi? Yep. Yeah. Sushi boy. Yep. Yeah. Hook it up with the Dodonzo and Sasori. Alright, moving on. We got uh, four uh, packs left, four? including this one. Yeah, including this one, we got four left. So, so far, well, technically we've gotten three hits because that one technically doesn't count as one. Right. But generally, you get three to four in a regular ETB. I don't know. The Pokemon Center does give you two extra packs, so it might be a little bit higher. Um, I don't know. I mean, don't quote me on that, but. Trying to speed it up just a little bit here. Oh, nice. It looks so good. Yeah, it does. It looks so good. The Iron Bundle future just looks really, yeah. really good. I like it a lot. And then, ooh, Latios. Oh, nice. Yeah. Legendary. So they put a lot of legendaries in the set. It seems to be the case. They have, um... Oh, I can't even think of their names right now. But lots of legendaries. Deoxys. Uh, Gerari, what is his name? Jirari. Yeah, the, the little star-headed Pokemon legendary. Is oh, Jirachi? Jirachi, yeah, Jirachi. Is there a Celebi here? I don't know. I don't have the entire list memorized. It's a big list, so I can't blame you. Yeah. Alright, let's see what we got here. Yamask. I'm just looking here because it's easier for me to just look at the camera. Oh, yeah, 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 for sure. And honestly, it's like the... Uh, the fidelity is good, so you can kind of. Ooh, what is that? A wind pod? It is a Golisopod. Golisopod, okay. Golisopod. Like so, nothing in that one. We did get the hollows, of course, but those were guaranteed. Yeah. So, we got the last two packs. Let's see if we can make something happen here. Two reverse hollows in every set, or in every pack. And then the card trick for this is just, of course, code card down, one card from the back, to put it forward. That's it. It made it real simple for this one. Yep. They did. That is true. Okay. Yeah. Yes. Oh, I don't think I've pulled that one. I don't yet. think you have either. Spinda. It's cute. Oh, oh we're yeah. just we're getting to cute central here. Oh, look at him. And Tinka Tink. That's got to be the biggest cute spree. There's gonna be a cute epic card in here. I feel it. Is right? it? I don't know. Is it gonna be there? It could be. Let's see. One oh, more. We got another one. Flittle. Here we go. Oh. And then they finish it off with the the non cutest <laughs> yeah. big boy. Big old salt boy. Yeah. Big old salt boy. Yeah, yeah. All right. All right. Uh, last pack. Last pack magic. This is gonna have a really good hit in it. I feel. You it. know how I know that? How do you know? Coping. <laughs> Copium. That is that is how I know. Maximum copium. Let's see. All right. Let's do this. It comes down to this. All right, Porygon, it's a good sign. That's my boy. Yeah. And Magby's my boy too. Hey. He's a little cutie too. Man, a lot of cute. Vanilla. Oh, yeah, there are a lot. Zev Striker, Crocolore, Ambipom. Oh. Reverse Holo, Masquerine. Okay. All right, Magby, give it to me. And nothing. Is that a Palkia though? So they do have a lot of legendaries in this one. Yeah, it was a Palkia. Yeah, yeah, it does. It does have. Uh, they do. It does have a lot of legendaries. It, it does. Did do did did did. It. I mean, calm down, bro. When, <laughs> sometimes it really just do be like that. It you know? do be da ba ba ba. Uh, he's T one emulator, yeah, dude. Yeah, T one emulator. You can't do it like T one. <laughs> no, dude. He's. he's He's got it perfected as an art. Oh, yeah, sometimes it really do does is be that way, <laughs> you know? Good. Yeah. yeah. Again, if you don't know what we're talking about, you probably think we're crazy, but Tyler won. You, you gotta love the guy. You gotta love him, man. All right, so it looks like we did a... So let's take this out. So so I've opened two Pokemon Center ETB, so it looks like three hits is what you're looking at. So 11 packs, three hits. Not that great, to be honest. But, I mean, you know... 
And there has there has been other content creators commenting on how the hit rates for the set are lower. Yeah. Um, Danny Pat, Phantom. Yeah. Yeah, he commented that the pull rates have been nerfed. Um, yeah. So, you know, it is what it is, though. I mean, you know, we got... It kind of depends how you look at it, right? I mean, you get three hits. If you're looking at it value-wise, you're probably not going to be too happy, depending on what you get. I mean, probably mostly all of what you get. <laughs> But if you're looking at it fun tax wise and maybe I can get something good, then it might be a little bit more worth it. Uh, as always though, booster boxes are gonna be the way to go for the most consistent hits. ETBs aren't really, I mean, it's not the greatest. I mean, to be honest, I mean, always go with booster boxes if you can afford it because while it's not officially seated, I mean, you're going to get 11 to 14 hits every single time. Yep. I mean, it's, it's already been proven. So, But, um, you know, it was fun. Uh, I do have two more ETBs, but I'm going to keep those uh, sealed for maybe one day. I want to open up a set that I can't open anymore or, you know, do whatever. But um, if you enjoyed this video, um, go ahead and uh, like and subscribe. Uh, I'll be uploading more in the future and i hope to see you guys around and thanks so much again my name is sam that's justin Hi. it's my brother and uh i hope you all have a good rest of your night and thanks for watching oh. this opening yeah what's up before we go show them the, the hits from the other set true okay so this is why i said that it's going to be three i'm glad you reminded me of that yeah so we opened an iron valiant before this um but the audio was messed up so we had to delete the whole thing because obviously you can't just reopen something um, but these are the three hits that I got from the Iron Valiant. So, yeah, that guy's so beast. This was the big boy that I got. Yeah, that was the big hit. But we also got three hits in the other ATV. So, I'm assuming three is even with the Pokemon Center ones. I don't know if the regular one's going to be three hits, but this one, it, it does seem to be three hits, uh, is the norm. And then we got a EX here. Yeah. And then uh, a Joltik. So this is what we pulled out of the other ETB, not this yeah. ETB. And that card is just amazing. Like Joltik sitting on yeah, top look, of the Yeah, yeah, Amper. yeah. It's so good. Yeah, look at it. Look how sitting cute. right on top of the Emperor. Yeah. yeah, I really like this card. <laughs> so, yeah, that's what we got. Uh, you could probably, that's basically what you're looking at, is three hits per ETB. I don't know if other people maybe have better hits, but this, in my experience, you're going to get three hits per ETB. So two Pokemon Center ETBs. This is what I got. Yeah. Um, so if you think about it, two Pokemon Center ETBs are like $65 after tax. It's $130. A booster box is $100. You know, yeah. $120, but it, they always go down to $100. So then you're, you're look at it this way. You're paying $130 for six hits, right? Or you could pay $100 or they're probably going to go down to $90 soon. Um, you could pay $90 for a booster box and you're guaranteed like $11 to $13. Always go with the booster box. I, I get the Pokemon Center ETBs just because I, I like the stamp promos. I, I need the promos anyway. I don't like buying the regular ETBs. But if you want the best bang for your buck, booster box always because ETBs are just not the way to go. You're not going to get not even close as much for the value. So, But anyways, thank you so much for watching. I will catch you guys in the next video. And I appreciate your time. And y'all take care. Peace out. Peace.